Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. Today is October 11th and 12.54. I'm on my lunch break from work. I am working and also packing here and there. Right now for my lunch, I'm gonna go out to the garage to help Kyle kind of clean up the garage and see what we need to keep, get rid of all of that jazz. So today's gonna be, or at least this vlog is gonna be very um moving oriented so we're gonna be packing and moving stuff we're just busy so that's what we're gonna do um i already packed most of my closet and i have gotten rid of a lot of clothes that i'm not wearing or that i don't use anymore i've donated some and i've given my parents some as well so they can take back to mexico so they can or my family there can sell it there so we've gotten rid of some stuff and i do actually have a couple bags that i want to take to plato's closet to see if they will give me money for my clothes because there's some stuff that's like really good and i would sell it on poshmark or is that what it's called i think it's called poshmark but i don't know if i'm i don't know i just don't know how to do that i never done that so i have no idea yeah gotten at least the clothes is pretty packed so um now we just have to kind of clear out the garage or at least have things packed in there so we can start putting boxes from in here to the garage so that's kind of where we're at i'm gonna take you to the garage now i'm just gonna kind of like set it up and do a time lapse of us clearing it out so let's go i am waiting dog okay this is what the garage is looking like um kyle got i think some stuff down from up here but most of this like the tree up here that's already packed that christmas stuff is packed and there's like a few boxes up there that will be kind of easy just to put in a u-haul i think so we don't have to do much there but obviously we have all of kyle's um what is it called tools Kyle's tools all on that wall so we got to figure that out we got some shoes a bunch of boxes that I think are ready to go question mark um and then all of this crap there's a lot of crap in here everything's just being thrown in here so we gotta oh all that's recyclable so we're gonna toss that we shall begin Are you helping? <laughs> wow, muy bien. Yeah. <laughs> Yay! All right, guys. So we're done with packing today. We're gonna go to dinner. This is my outfit. I'm wearing this skirt from Cotton On and this little cardigan from h&m i think and it's super comfortable so and i think it was like super cheap very very comfy and yeah this skirt from cotton on we're gonna go to coronado this time and we're gonna go to the pizza place and obviously taking you guys along so these are our outfits and i'm gonna get amelia and we'll be ready to go
far away from my hometown With my family I am bound I stick by them till I'm in the ground Resting on the myth of old All of the stories have been told Secret places hidden well Are gone now as far as I can tell It is October 17th and our house is pretty much packed or almost packed. I haven't picked up my camera since last or this past weekend and we got so much done. Um, we pretty much have everything packed except Amelia's room and like small things like bathroom stuff or obviously our couch will probably go in last. I have no idea. But um, yeah, our house is pretty much packed. Let me show you. So we have some boxes. I need to go into the garage. I mean, it looks like a mess, but it's an organized mess. And then our dining table is gone. We have some extra boxes here. And this box is going with us to our new place. And speaking of, we don't have a house yet. We won't have a house when we get to Texas, but we will be renting an apartment for three months. And during that time, we're gonna, you know, be there and have the opportunity to go look at houses. So we will be looking for a house in the next three months. And yeah, we'll be living in an apartment. So kind of the plan right now. Um, I'm making breakfast. We actually have a meeting in like three minutes. So I gotta go and I'll see you guys after. So I am at my eyelash place. This is the last fill that I get here in San Diego and it's so bittersweet. Um, I really don't need one right now, but since I'll be in New Mexico for two weeks, I thought I should just come get a fill so at least I'm good through all of New Mexico. And I already found a new place in Texas, so I'm really excited to try them. But yeah, this is my last fill here, and it's so bittersweet and sad. But I am, I don't even know how I'm feeling. I don't think it's hitting me yet. Um, it's Thursday today, and I fly out on Sunday, Sunday night. So we get at least all of Saturday and most of Sunday to do things so I think that's what's keeping me happy <laughs> I don't know and I do have to go to Target after because I need to return this water bottle because I hate the color it's ugly it's the what is this called Owala water bottle and I mean I love the water bottle I just don't like the color Oops, someone's calling me okay so the my appointment's delayed by a whole 15 minutes. I should have just gone to Target. I'm so mad. Ugh. I was going to go before. And then I was like, you know what? I should just go after because I don't want to be late. And now my appointment's delayed. It's fine. 
Anyways, I'm gonna go to Target after this and return this water bottle because it is not the color I wanted. I don't know why. I'm not a purple person. So I don't know why I got it. But it's the 24 ounce water bottle and it's so cool because it like pops up. And then this is actually the straw. So like you can just go and you know drink out of it. But I just didn't like the color. So I'm gonna return it. And since I'm playing out this weekend, I wanted a water bottle that didn't have like the straw sticking out. So this would be perfect for that. And it's not like super heavy, 32, 30, whatever, 40 ounce water bottle. So this would be perfect to carry. And yeah. So I'm going to do that. I didn't vlog any of the packing just because it's been hectic and our house has been literally crazy. If you have moved before, if you, you know, you know how it is. But our house is almost packed. And like I mentioned earlier, we have movers coming to help us move our stuff into the U-Haul. Which is going to be so nice because I'm hoping, we booked them for three hours. And I'm hoping that we can get it done in three hours. And that way... We pretty much have all of Saturday free, or at least half of Saturday free. And, you know, enjoy our last few, you know, days here. So, thank God for movers, and they're going to help us. I know my parents did offer to come help, and also Kyle's parents, but we were like, no, we got this. Like, we're going to do it ourselves. And then now that we have Amelia, it's a little bit harder. And because before we've moved twice before and we've done it ourselves both times and it's been like long moves like big moves and We've done it ourselves and it's totally fine, but with Amelia It's it's a little harder and our furniture upstairs is so heavy. So there's no way I would be able to help. So Yeah it's Exciting things. So now not my appointment Got delayed. I'm just gonna be sitting in the car for a few minutes I'll have to ask Kyle what he wants for dinner because I probably will just pick up dinner or something like a chipotle thing.